So, it's been a while since I made a video. Thank you to everyone who stuck around this whole time that I was extremely busy with college. And yes, that is what happened. College is probably the main reason that I took a gap year of sorts. I graduated with my bachelor's degree and then I decided that I wanted to go on to grad school. So I started applying to grad schools and that took up a giant amount of my time. But yeah, I'm here. Everything is perfectly fine. Thank you to everyone who reached out to me and asked me if everything was okay. Everything is okay. All the animals are doing great. They're all back there. So I've been thinking a lot about the future of my YouTube channel and there are a ton of different paths that I can go down. Those of you who have watched my past few videos have seen that I've been talking a lot about the stuff that I'm interested in beyond animals. So there's obviously a passion for animals and then Aside from that, we have my passion for technology and my passion for technology is what led me to studying computer science for my master's degree. I also have a big creative side, so I love everything that's video editing and music production. And I wanted to lean a little bit more into those other creative interests. So one thing that I want to do is try to use my own music in my videos. And I just see that as a way of grasping my full creative potential, if that's how you want to word it. I think it's a really cool idea. Uh, it's going to be a challenge for me, but you know, challenges are great. That's how you grow. And that is actually what I want to help other people with, with my channel. I want to help other people challenge themselves and grow, whether that be creatively or academically. And I've had a ton of really cool experiences in the past year that I think I can really help other people with. I think that one thing that's really important is knowing that you're not alone in your struggles. I am very happy right now, but I struggled a lot to get to where I am. I would say I put a lot of pressure on myself. I haven't made a video in a while, but I've been putting a lot of pressure on myself academically. In the background, there is a lot of work being put in on my end to uh, learn about upcoming technologies things like augmented or virtual reality are things I'm really interested in. And then there's things such as brain computer interfaces, <laughs> but I'm not even gonna get into that whole field cause that's just insane. Like maybe when I live stream, I can talk a little bit more about it and then talk about what I think the future of technology is gonna be like, cause that's something that really interests me. I'm very passionate about education and I do think that YouTube has been a giant force in education recently. With my own channel, I've been able to educate millions of people about my animals. And I think these tools that we have today are just so insane. By tools, I mean platforms like YouTube. Like, without a platform like YouTube, I don't know what we do today. I mean, if YouTube didn't exist, something else would exist. And it's all about facilitating communication. YouTube helps people communicate with each other better uh, or more efficiently and we're just going to keep figuring ways figuring out ways to better communication and with better communication we're going to have better education and it's going to be great so yeah that's why i want to focus so much of my time on tech i think that work in tech is super important for advancing causes like the sustainable development goals one goal that i personally support is number four quality education my channel has been supporting that for the past few years and it's been a lot of fun and i want to keep doing this i want to keep i want to keep making videos i don't plan on stopping even though i haven't uploaded in a while um i do hope i can live stream because i have live streamed in the past a ton and you guys seem to really enjoy it so let's see what else so besides college something else that happened in 2021 that was really cool was that i got featured in the new york times and i have that right here and I'm still working on the frame a little bit. I printed out the pictures that they took of me and I'm going to be putting them up right there next to the newspaper. So that's going to be cool, but I'm not going to talk about that too much in this video. I'll probably talk about that in the next video. I have been taking a lot of really cool pictures lately uh, on my Instagram. I posted a picture of my green bottle blue tarantula and another one of my carpet python. And you guys would be surprised how long those take to edit. I would be willing to make a video about how I edit my pictures because I think some of you would be interested in that. I love the whole editing process, so that would probably be a lot of fun to make. 
and I just got a new computer that is super insane. Let me get it right here. It is the MacBook Pro, the M1 MacBook Pro. It is the coolest thing ever. It's got the little notch up here, just like the iPhones. It's so insane, super powerful. And that is what I use to edit my photos now. I had a Windows laptop before and I still use the Windows laptop a ton. Uh, but uh, yeah, I'm just switching between Apple and Windows computers all the time. Also, I got a new iPhone. I got the iPhone 13 Pro Max, which if you guys were following me super closely, I switched over to Samsung and I had a Galaxy for a ton of years, probably four years. I had the Galaxy S8 and I had the Galaxy S10. It was pretty cool to switch over back to iPhone after so many years. And I'm really loving the phones. The camera quality is insane. And to top it all off, I took those pictures that you see on my Instagram of the green bottle blue tarantula and the carpet python. I took those with this phone. So that just shows you how insane this is. You guys know I like to dye my hair a lot, but recently I've just kept it natural and I grew it out and it's super long but I really like how it looks with hats. So I've been wearing a lot of trucker hats recently. Let's see, what else? I went to Washington DC, I went to Boston. Boston was really cool. I went to Washington DC with a bunch of friends from high school. That was a lot of fun. I also remodeled the garage a little bit. Well, you guys saw the desk. The desk is like completely remodeled, but I also added like new floors. So there you go, there's new floors here and that's like a huge upgrade for me. I really want to answer some of the questions that you guys have for me. So please just leave any questions in the comments and then in the next video, I'll probably go through them and answer them on camera. Or if anything, I will start live streaming and then we'll just answer them on there and we'll keep the conversation going. I think this is really cool. And yeah, that's pretty much it for this video. Thanks for watching.